We're going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Also, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And salutations to all you brothers out there. And, um, you know, hey, we, we've just been uh, talking about a couple different things oh. in, um, at camp. And pretty much, um, can you uh, get that scripture where it talks about put off the old man? Because, okay. um, you know, the, the elder Yach brought it out. You know, you can't conform, all right, to this world. And we got to conform to the image of Yahweh Shai. Okay, and that's whom the, this world ignorantly calls, you know, Jesus Christ. I'm, you know, I'm just, you know, saying that for edification's sake. That's right. All right, but his true name is Yahweh Shai. That's right. Okay? And when you, um, you know, read about Yahweh Shai, Okay, you know, it talks about how he was austere, meaning he was very manly, okay, masculine. He, uh, um, he wasn't soft, you know, he followed the law, you see? And we're supposed to be, you know, following our, um, hey, the prototype, yeah, okay? That's right. right. You know, that the, 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 the true, you know, that true example on uh, uh, how, you know, to be, all right? You see? And that, and, and look, if you don't, follow a hey, the ways of Yahweh Bashim Al Shai is just gonna lead to death. That's right. Okay, so it's best that you, you know, take heed and change your ways. Alright, put off that old man. Because it's not beneficial to you. And as we were bringing out in, in um on the other side, right at the main camp, we were talking about how messed up our people are right now. Yeah. You know, it doesn't matter what tribe area you go to. All right, it doesn't matter what country they're in. That's right. They're all messed up. That's right. Real messed up. And that's because they're rebellious. Mm -hmm. See? But um, whatever you uh, brothers got. I got what you call for. Come. This is the book of uh, Ephesians chapter 4 and verse 21. If What's 20 say? Con, uh, I'll start at 20. This uh, Ephesians chapter 4 and verse 20. Uh, it's, uh, yeah, I don't know if we're going to start at 19. Uh, just start at 20. Start Con, at 20. Yeah. Con. This is Ephesians chapter 4 and verse 20. But ye have not so learned Hamashiach. If so, be that ye have heard him and have been taught by him yeah. as the truth is in Yahweh Shai. Yeah, the truth is in Yahweh Shai. Okay, keep, and really, what does it say in the scriptures that what? He, he's the bread of life? Mm -hmm. All right, this word, you see? Everything that, that's in this uh, Bible is true. Okay, keep reading. This is Ephesians 4 and 22. That ye put off concerning the former conversation, the old man. That, right. that goes into your conduct. Right. Keep going. Which is corrupt according to the deceitful lusts. Exactly, it's corrupt. You know, hey, hey, they, you, your, your flesh is covetous. All right, it's envious, hateful. That's right. Okay. You know, it, it, it has, you know, no control, mm -hmm. you see? Mm -hmm. And you got to get rid of these things. You you can't think carnally anymore once you come into this truth. That's right. All right? You, you have to be spiritual. Hey, to be carnally minded is death. That's right. That's what the scriptures say in Romans 8 and 6. And that's a, the, the majority of the mindset of our people. And this is why all you see in our communities is nothing but death, yeah. okay? Yeah. You know, destruction, corruption. That's right so on and so forth is right. is bad that's why the scriptures talk about how what uh the the, the, the land mourneth all right it, you know it languisheth and it's not not the one in isaiah 24 but the one in uh hosea the fourth chapter God. you know because i mean seriously you you go to uh, you know where judah's at you go to where, where you ephraim mm -hmm. issachar whatever you know you go where gad's at mm -hmm. it, it's it's like a wasteland man that's right it's literally like a wasteland out there that's right yeah. Right. Jake loves to have his soul. It's even a, um, it's a common practice for Jake when they go out of town to other cities to go and um, present themselves to the hood wherever they at. Yep. You got these Jakes, they come to Chicago, their first stop is not on the river or, or at, the, at right. the Willis Tower or the Sears Tower or whatever they call it. It's not at Navy Pier. These oh, niggas want to go to Old Block and take a picture with King Von, yeah. who was a demon. Exactly. And a murderer and an adulterer. Yep. But that's just the Faggy way it too. is. Yeah, that's that's right. I don't give a fuck, man. Yeah. They, they, anybody that's not in this truth is a faggot. And lay, lay, we we've been mentioning it for the past few weeks, probably months now. That look, hey, 
all these tough guys, these you know, these thugs, these gangsters, man. Mm -hmm. They, they, they're all gay, man. That's right. Mm -hmm. They're all gay. That's Every right. single one of them, man. That's right. All right. I forgot who it was. We, I, I be forget, man, because they're they're they're, 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 they're <laughs> so like gay. fucking little gremlins yeah. and minions and shit. They yeah. come and go within yeah. like fucking two, cockroach. three years. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. I know the one dude that was you know out here in Chicago, right? One of them fucking you know rappers with you know King Vaughn and Lil Durk and all that. When they, they had footage of him talking about he was a uh, homosexual, bro. Oh, you, know, you talking about video. dude when he was in the yeah this guy he He's went to County. he went to the joint and uh you yeah. know he was dealing with a uh, a Decepticon in the joint and then he you know he said it was he, he wasn't a mo he just was All yeah folly just folly no no shame they got a footage of King Von acting like a mo inside jail yeah that's yeah yep. yeah it was King Von they were saying mm -hmm. right now he was just doing that to get. Uh, uh, protective custody and shit. Like, nah, man, this dude was in there. So I thought you was. A, I thought you was a gangster, bro. Right. Yeah, a lot of them, they, especially these youngins, man. Yeah, a lot of them, man, they they, they 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 be fighting each other, fucking each other. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? All type oh, of shit. They just, just to prove dominance and shit. Ugh. That's really what be going on, yeah. man. Yeah. They're they're they're, <laughs> that's the spirit of Esau, man. They're going after the lust of their father, man, who was Esau. That's who they've accepted as their father. And that's what yeah. Esau used to do to you niggers back in, in in particular in Jamaica, but um all over when 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 Jake was in, in chattel slavery. They was buck breaking Jake's to, to establish dominance over the whole uh population of slaves that they had control over. They'll get the biggest gangsterous looking, uh Terry Crews looking slave that they got, and they'll break his back, pause. And that's what is going on. Too. Exactly. Exactly. In front of his woman, in front of his kids, in front of the whole population of slaves, man. And that's just carried over into today, man. Yep. And that's why, like the uh, elder brother said, all of these gangsters and these big dudes that you think is mighty, they're just moles, man. That's why even their conduct is the conduct of a woman. Yep. You, you yeah, come on. Come on. This is uh, Ephesians 4 and verse... I'm going to read 22 again. That ye put off concerning the former conversation, the old man, mm -hmm. which is corrupt according to deceitful lust, and be renewed in the spirit of your mind, and that ye put on the new man, which after Yahweh is created in righteousness and true holiness. Exactly. And that's what you're supposed to do. All right? You got to put on the, the, the new man. You know, your mind has to be changed. Yep. You know, you, you have to start practicing what the Lord uh, 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 said to do, you know, the law, statutes, and commandments. Mm -hmm. All right, and I'll say this: at first, it's hard. It's not easy. That's right. You know, even to uh, brothers who've been in it, you know, in this thing for some time, hey, you you have your battles. Yeah. But I'll right. say this: when you're when you're uh, first, you know, when you first come in, hey, you you, you got a, a, a lot of changing to do. You got to kill that flesh, man. That's right. What does the scripture say? Mortify the flesh. Uh -huh, you know. All right. Because they, they, a lot of brothers, they, they they were smoking heavy, doing drugs. All right, maybe they were into you know, uh, you know the, the church, which is idolatry. Maybe they were into game banging, you know, woman worshiping, whatever it is, you know. And when I say woman worship, it's not just elevating one woman. I'm saying that that whole spirit of pussy chasing. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. That like that that depth down. Right? You, you know what I mean? <laughs> and you got to learn how to you know uh, control yourself. Yeah. And it's going to make you feel uncomfortable because change yeah. is, is uncomfortable. That's right. But in the end, it, 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 it um, produces positive results. That's right. Yeah. That's why, you know, we always talk about, you know, uh, 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 you know, uh, uh, you know, basically, you know, we don't want to be that old man. Yeah. Brothers mentioned that quite often. I don't want to be that guy anymore. Yeah. You know, I, I'm trying to stay as far away as I, uh, as I can from that guy, you know. And then, you know, hey, brothers hey, brothers have lost weight, you know, are healthy, you know what I'm saying? That's right. They, they've cured particular ailments through, right. the, through the herbs. That's right. That's a part of our culture, all right, ha having a good diet, mm -hmm. you know, like being fit. Yep. They, now brothers are able to, you know, uh, 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 talk to one another because you might have had a brother that was a hothead in the world. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Hey, hey, now he's cool, calm, and collective. You wouldn't even think, damn, man, this brother was a... I had you was always getting into brawls and fights. I wouldn't expect that. Look, look how calm and cool he is and, and humble. Yeah. See, but he's changed, you know? Uh.
see? Uh, I got what you got. We got real brotherly love here. That's you know? Because, you know, in, uh, in this world, you, you do something for somebody, and these people expect something in return. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. All right, and then in this world, they'll start hounding you. You know, hey, hey, bro, you, you got that, uh, uh that hundred that, that, you know? Yeah. That, 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 that you know what I'm saying? It's like, bro, yeah. like, yeah. shit, I'm fucked up. Like, hey, can you give me a little extra time? Right. Some of these people, damn, they're like, kill you over, over a loan, bro. Yeah. Shit, this one rapper said, I kill, I kill a clown. Basically, off his money, he said, I don't care if it was $10. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's the mass of a nigga there. Straight Man, straight. I just seen motherfuckers, family, so-called family, beat, beat the shit out of a nigga. Beat, beat them like a nigga in the, in the world, man. Yeah. Over a little amount of money. Matter of yeah. fact, over damn near nothing, man. Yeah. Get into arguments and just beat the shit out of that nigga. Knock him out. Like, yeah. that, that shit is just bugged out and folly, man. Yeah. Ain't yeah. no real camaraderie in the world, man. Yeah. Them niggas, all, it's, they all about themselves. A dog eat dog sis. That's it. That ain't our culture, though. That's right. And the worst part about that is, is that Jacob be so... How, how so hot and ready to get their money back when you lend them some money, but to be but to be quick to be forgetful of good turns yep. when you fucked up and you need a helping hand, yep. and, and Jacob act like they don't they don't know what you're talking about or they ain't got it, man. T Rex mm -hmm. arms on me. Yeah, <laughs> but to be quick, but but I want to smoke you for five dollars, man. If if they lend you five dollars, they want to smoke you. It's just straight folly, man. I got that Romans for you. Bro. Yep. This is uh, Romans 8 and 12. Therefore, brethren, we are debtors, mm. not to the flesh, to live after the flesh. Mm. For if ye live after the flesh, ye shall die. But if ye, through the Spirit, do mortify the deeds of the body, ye shall live. Exactly. Hey, you, you, you'll live. Is that Romans 8 for you? Yes, eight? sir. Yes, sir. Go to uh, Romans 8 and 6. Come. Romans 5, 6. Let's do five. Start at five. This is Romans chapter eight and verse five. For they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh, mm -hmm. but they that are after the spirit, the things of the spirit. Yeah, keep going. For to be carnal, carnally minded is death, yep. but to be spiritually minded is life and peace. Exactly. It's life and peace. That's right. Okay. That's why you got to mortify the flesh. You know, you got to hey, kill, kill off that, 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 that carnal mind uh, state. That's okay. Right. You know, you got to be kingdom minded. That's right. Hey, look, if you're kingdom minded, they, that's nothing but peace, tranquility, okay, honor, respect, true equity. You know, you see, that's the, the, the that's the spirit you're supposed to be in. That's right. You know, you're supposed to uh, judge righteous judgment. You know, I like the, the this world that we live in. Hey, you got to have mercy, compassion. That's right. You know what I'm saying? There, there's so many things that go into it. That's right. But this world, it's like how the brother said, I forgot which brother said it, but uh, it's a dog-eat-dog -dog world, yeah. you know? That's what we're in, and that's because that's the way of Esau. That's right. Yep. Because Esau is all about his flesh, all about himself, you know? Yeah. And you're not supposed to be like that. That's right. You know? And then it's, it's clear as day, this is that type of, I'll say this, that, that mindset is the problem that we're having in this earth. That's right. Because you got to remember, the scriptures say what? In uh, uh, Revelation 20, it talks about Babylon, right? And uh, 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 it says Babylon has what? The souls of men, meaning their minds. Okay? Esau has these people's minds out here. That's right. And, 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 and just, you know, for edification's sake, you know, um, Babylon and Esau go hand in hand. Okay? You know? That, that's in Psalms 137. Mm -hmm. Talks about how he's what the uh, the virgin daughter of Babylon. You know what I'm saying? All right. So like I said, and, and who's running Babylon anyways? He saw even the so-called white man, and now his mindset is all over the world. And look how destructive it is to this entire planet. The people are mourn. Okay, when the wicked are in authority. That's right. Yes. You're seeing that right now. Everybody's mourning. It doesn't matter if you're here. You're in Europe. Yeah. Okay. You're you're you know one of these Asian countries, yeah. Africa, South America. Mm -hmm. Everybody's in a state of mourning right now, and that's because they're following the ways of Esau Edom. You know. That's right. Yep. Yeah. Don't let don't let the because a lot of these people are all just bad actors. Don't allow this fake act that people put on in public 
to make you think that it's not snow because these people will have you believe that everything is kosher mm -hmm. and it's not for them man yeah everything is going down the drain here all right and it's getting worse and worse and you know the thing about babylon is that because it's the leading power of this world all these other nations think they're going to band together and it, it, but, but but what you don't understand is that this world is so heavily invested in babylon that when babylon falls no matter what these other nations try to do it's not going to work everything is going to fall with babylon man. yeah even it talks about in second ezra it talks about uh, asia and, you know you're basically a partaker of, of, of babylon mm -hmm. all right hey they got the same mindset look you you go to uh, china right now you go to uh, japan you go to you know uh, what is it uh, singapore yeah. right yeah, yeah. They all, they all got suit and ties, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They all have, uh, you know, uh, just basic jeans and you know yeah. t-shirts and all that stuff now too. Yeah. They don't have, they, they don't wear their, you know, their ancient, you yeah, know, garments. Traditional garb. Their tra traditional garments yeah. anymore. You don't see that. Yeah. That's that, that's gone. Looks like Koreatown over there. <laughs> <laughs> so nope. was, some bitch was uh, interviewing people on the street. I don't know if she's in Japan or some shit, but she's like, how do how do you feel about you know? Everyone not wearing the, you know, like you were just saying, the traditional garments they used to have, the yukatas and shit they had on. Mm -hmm. She's like, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of people, you know, they don't wear it anymore. And I, I feel like that's, you know, slipping out the culture. The bitch was speaking on it. And a lot of people she was interviewing was saying the same thing because nobody's wearing that shit no more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Moab on the same shit as Esau right now, right. man. Booty face as hell. They yeah. ain't mm -hmm. all steer or nothing, man. It's soft as hell, man. Mm -hmm. And they think they got next, too. That's funny that you mentioned that, though, right with, the, uh, with them shaving. They, they, that's seriously eating my custom. Yeah. They're the ones who introduced, well, you know what? Let me rephrase that. It actually started with ham. All right, but you know, Esau, they took it to the next yeah. level, you know? Yeah. Okay? But hey, you know, you look at all these um, different uh, uh, cultures, right? You know, you look at the ancient Chinese culture, Japanese, all right, the, you know, these Arabs, you know, so on and so forth. They all had, you know, facial hair. Even if they didn't have a full beard, right. they had, you know, facial hair. Uh, yeah, mustache or goatee or something. You know, something, something man. Yeah, something. <laughs> but see, you know, now we're in, in the time period where everyone's trying to mimic and imitate Esau even the so-called white man. And the reason why is because he's on top. So they think that, oh, since he's doing this, all right, and since he's on top, you know, right. this is how, how you prosper. Yep. But it's not. Because yeah, right. it's all going to lead to a downfall. All right? You know? You got it, Doc. Con, I got a quick one to just... Uh reiterate what you were saying this is uh first maccabees chapter 1 and verse 41 moreover king antiochus wrote to his whole kingdom mm. that all should be one people and everyone should leave his laws Ooh. so all the heathen agreed according to the commandment of the king yep. all right and that's what the, the elder brother's talking about man yeah because at the end of the day you know they'll they'll put all of these fake leaders in front of your face but none of these people are the ones that are really in charge it's the people that got all the money that's in charge and in order for your country to get financed by these people you have to agree to follow behind their ways that's why places like cuba who refuse to agree now they still wicked but they refuse to agree wholeheartedly with what those bankers want that's why their country is desolate yep. iran is another example of that that was a flourishing place that was one of the top places for tourism all the way up to the 1960s. And then, you know, once they didn't want to get down with those bankers, now it's a wasteland. Yep. All right, North Korea, the same thing. They don't want to fully get down with what these with what these bankers are talking about. So they place it, they land is desolate, man. They don't have shit. People die in a starvation. Yeah, exactly. Because you're yeah. either going to do after the way it is heathen or you're not going to be able to partake in his blessing, man. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. But guess what? Those who partake in his blood, first of all, if you a heathen, it's over with for you. Smooth. So let me just say that. But for all you janks that want to partake in his blessing because you or, and go after his ways because you want a piece of the pie, like the elder Yak always say, you know, just know that you're going to have to take everything else that comes with that, too. You're not just going to get the yeah. good parts of the deal, man. You're going to have to get destroyed with these devils because you wanted to live a certain way, man. I was going to uh, bring out, we just had a, uh, an example. They look like maybe Moab, mm -hmm. and I'm not really sure, you know, where they were from. Chino, sure. All right, hey, but, they, you know, they, they had the shaved face. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah. You know, T-shirt and yeah, jeans. Yeah, you Moabites right. supposed to be having the Fu Manchu 
with the chopsticks in your hair like Pai Mei. What happened to that? That shit long gone. Why you? What do you think of this guy? <laughs> <laughs> that nigga look like Mr. Rogers, Joe. Oh, oh shit. He got the jacket on, too. He's gonna go home with oh, that cardigan man. on next. <laughs> but, but see, your know, point being, though, is everyone's following after Esau just because he's empowered. That's right. And that doesn't mean it's right, though. That's why the scriptures say what? Envy now uh, thou the oppressor? That's you know, right. Because look, right. choose none of his ways. Because, see, people don't know the, the latter end of this guy. That's mm -hmm. the thing. Yeah. Mm hmm. They just see, you know, you know, his height right now, you know, him being, you know, an authority. But they, 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 they don't consider what's to come very soon to him, you know. And it talks in that, um, in that Job twenty, the very end, because it talks about the rise and basically downfall of Esau in one chapter. And it, at the very end, it says what? No, this is the portion of a wicked man. All right, and it's what his destruction. And that's what's coming. This guy is going to be utterly destroyed. And you all want to follow this? But see, you know what it is? They don't have that vision, that foresight. So they, so they can't believe it. Right. You know? So that's why they call us crazy. That's why, they, see, all these people, they, they have the mindset of, of what? Who, who can make war with the beast? Mm -hmm. that, that's what's in their mind. That's right. Who can take this guy down? What, what are you guys talking about? Right. Look, he, he, look at his uh, military um, advancements. All right, his, his, his technology, his you know medical care, yeah. so on and so forth. Ha, what? Mm -hmm. You're saying that, 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 that this guy is not you know the Lord's chosen? Right. And then, yeah, we're saying yeah, he's not. Nigger. <laughs> All right. You see? What you got? I'm gonna back you up. This is uh, Psalms chapter 49 and verse 11. Mm -hmm. Their inward thought is that their houses shall continue Ooh. forever, Beautiful. and their dwelling places to all generations. They call their lands after their own names. And you know, this is talking about Esau in particular, but the thought that, that their houses are gonna continue forever, all of these heathens have that same mentality. Yep. They believe that Esau is never gonna get taken out of power, man. Mm -hmm. They think that the white man is just gonna be in charge forever. Wrong. Think about all these other kingdoms. If that was the case, why is it the first kingdom that was in power still in power right now? Uh-huh. All right? Like the elder Yak always says, all of these all of these kingdoms, they have a certain amount of time allotted for them to rule. And when their time expires, their time expires and the next one comes. And it doesn't matter how things look on paper because the Lord is the one who decides who's gonna be ruling and who isn't. So you can have all of these weapons and all this shit that you think you're doing and you'll still lose. Yeah, it, it, look man, it's like, we, you know, we're, we're fighting, right? You know, we, a lot of brothers watch boxing. You know, MMA and all that, right? That's right. They what they call what the underdog. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Everything is stacked against him. Like even that uh, the situation with the uh, Usman versus uh, uh, um, Leon Edwards. Yeah, yeah. Bro, literally, before the fight, it's like this. It, yeah. First off, he lost before. You know, yeah. once before. Yeah. yeah. All right. Hey, Usman's been champ for how long? He's defended how many times? Mm -hmm. He's been beaten ass, literally. Yeah. That's a loss in the UFC. Everybody you know what I'm looks like they. Everybody looks like they um are undefeatable until they get defeated exactly then even during the fight four rounds of just getting dominated even the fifth round bro he he was like all right bro it was, it was, it was damn to cut yeah, the it shit off like over. it's over it's but over. it only takes one second yeah man. and then yeah. boom head kick one, yeah Headshot, headshot dead. Boom. <laughs> yeah. That dude, that That's all it takes is one second, man. Words for those two You know, that's a whole nother story. Let's not talk about that, brother. <laughs> you know, the point being, though, is hey, if the, if the Lord's with you, hey, you're going to win, man. You're yeah. going to get the victory. Yeah. Simple as that. Yeah. All right? And that's what's going to happen to, 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 to the elect, man. They're going to get the big W yeah. over the beast. That's, okay? Yeah. And, yeah. and everyone's going to be in awe on that, like, these are the Lord's chosen people. These are the ones that are getting, you know, the win. Yes, nigger. All right. That's right. You know, because the Lord, he, he he's about to uh, um, upgrade us. You know, it, 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 man, it, things are coming. Hey, uh, Lord willing, I get uh, to this lesson. I've been wanting to get to it. Um, you just haven't done it. Hey, but we're about to spiritually cash out, bro. That's right. We're about to spiritually cash out on this investment. That's right. And we're about to be a, you know, the baller, so to speak. You know what I'm saying? It's coming. And, and you people, you're losing. 
fucking just losing. That's right. Every single one of you people are losing, man. That's right. You gotta keep working. You're nine to five. You're depressed, stressed. Mm -hmm. All right, on drugs. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not getting laid. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Getting laid too much. Yeah. And then, hey, the, the reason why I say this because then you got some people that fuck so much, they're just through, man. Look at these hoes out here. Yeah. Even you dudes, yeah. man. Yeah. You 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 uh, yeah you fucked how many bitches? How many times? But you can't keep a fucking stable relationship. You're just bugged the fuck out, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. A lot of right. them, them, them porn stars, because I was yeah. watching this interview of a porn star, bro. Yeah. This dude was so unhappy with his life. Even though he you know, dealt with all these top models, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Got it, you know, yeah. he got his rod used, you know, how many times, right? <laughs> yeah, most females all right? want to deal with it. But, yeah, but, yeah, but yeah. he was so depressed, and he said, he's like, I just can't find a wife. Like, I can't yeah, find yeah. anything. Yo? He's like, he's like I'm, I don't care about being with all these women. I just want to find somebody yeah. that actually loves me for, you know, yeah. who I am. You know what I mean? Because yeah. it runs out after that. It's at, the, at the end of the day, you know, the more common something becomes, the less you're able to appreciate. It. Yep. All right. This dude's life every day is doing the same thing over and over. Eventually, you're going to get bored. All right. Even if it is dealing with women. All right. You can, I'm sure everybody has a favorite food or a favorite particular meal that they like eating. You eat that for a month straight and then see how much you want to eat that shit again, man. Exactly. <laughs> you know, it'll, it'll get to the point where it makes you sick to your stomach to try to eat that. Yep. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> you know? So, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, you got a scripture? Yeah, yeah I got yeah. Go ahead. And a lot of these uh, adult film stars and shit, they ask, on heavy antidepressants, on heavy yeah. hard drugs, yeah. and they often they sell. Yeah. At an alarming yeah. rate. Cause it's, 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 look, man, if it's not the ways of Yahweh Shimel Shai, it's, it's just, it's death, man. Yeah. It's destructive. Yeah. It's not prosperous. Yeah. Eventually, it gets you. That's yeah. the thing. All your, you know, your vices, all the things that you love, lust after, mm. it, it eventually, you know, eats you up. This, uh, this Psalms 92 and 6 A brutish man knoweth not Neither doth a fool understand this mm -hmm. When the wicked spring as the grass mm -hmm. And when all the workers of iniquity do flourish mm -hmm. It is that they shall be destroyed forever mm -hmm. And that's the point the brothers was going into man These niggas think oh he saw us up out of the game making a scamming nigga He's getting all his money he's fucking all these hoes To do with the dreads He's doing this he's yeah. doing that yeah. He's in a limelight, these rappers are up and this down the third. Yeah. But at the end of the day, these niggas gonna have to uh, uh, get the judgment that comes with that. That's right. And say so you hold on the side of the devil, you go find it. You go find that death, man, that That's second right. death. That's right. These news go hit so ass. These plagues you ain't gonna have no hedge from, man. That's right. And then it's gonna, it's just gonna say many that are uh, uh, last are gonna be first and many that's first gonna be last. Then these niggas gonna be, I mean, they already through. It's just everyone's gonna see their through. Yeah. That's right. They're not gonna have the, um, the ability to hide under that one, put the cover over you and shit, hide under the bed and shit, yeah. pop the peel, man, yeah. snort the land, come outside of face mouth, leave face people hating on you and shit. Yeah. Hey, that's like going to be thrown out the window, man. That's right. Then you yeah. go see who these niggas really are. Is it? But, uh, but, uh, I was gonna say, um, you know, especially here in America, like. <laughs> You people don't really know what judgment is, man. Like, you know, a thing or two happens, you know, here yeah, in America. Yeah. You might be, you know, somebody died in a shooting. Yeah. You know, maybe a, a house is set on fire. You know, a couple things like that. But it, it's not like these other countries where they, they see this on the daily. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. They may have had to even execute judgment themselves. You know what I'm saying? They used to. You know, they, they, they become hardened. You know what I'm saying? You, you people in America are so soft. So when this hits you, it... it it's gonna be like getting hit by a goddamn fucking freight train. You know what right. I'm saying? That's right. All right. Hey, you're you're really gonna be in a in a world of sorrow soon. Yeah. Because they now say this: the Lord don't have to kill you right away. See, because people think like, oh, the Lord's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like. But you don't understand. The Lord can torture you. Like legit. Like just bring you down bit by bit. Like. Dude, we're talking about the king of terrors here. Right. The Lord can slow you, okay? Strip away your health. Yeah. Take the job away from you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, take the woman. Yeah. Oh, now you're getting robbed. 
Now your family's against you. Damn. Now, oh, now you got an infection. You, you know what I'm have. saying? Yeah. You got all these different things. Oh, now, now we're getting serious because it's Jacob's trouble. Yeah. Oh, oh, now you're not eating for days. Hey, now, now somebody is trying to eat you. Oops. All right. Oh, somebody's trying to rape you. Pause. Damn. Take that. Take yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, wake up in the morning. Oh, Mike's you, you, Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he said, Mike's way. Look, <laughs> now, you, now you wake up in the morning and you look like Kunta Kinte because the nigga done chopped your foot off. Yeah. Mm. So, you know, it, 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 it's crazy. The Lord can make you survive all that and just the last thing you, you, you see in your life is just a missile coming from the sky, bro. Oh. And you can't do nothing about it. You're just oh. sitting there and you just, all of a sudden you just see all these missiles coming. Yep. The, you know, the sun gets blocked yeah. out. Now it's dark, and you just know it's the end. It's yeah. over. Well, that's what not they, gonna take place quick either. What did they say? You know, what was it the movie The Knowing? You know, <laughs> they hugged each other. It's over. All right. it, it's a wrap. They, they knew it. Like, hey, <laughs> that, that, that fire's coming. But what did they, it's crazy because it's a spiritual movie. Yeah, what did what did the uh, the old Edomite say? The time, uh, um, not Tom Cruise. What's that dude's name? Oh God, what's that fucking guy's name? He played in um. Fucking the Ghost Rider. What's that dude's name? Nicholas Cage. Nicholas yeah, Cage. Nicholas. He he said uh, um the Edomite said to to, to Nicholas Cage's character because they were son and father. He said he said this is not the end. Why did he say that? Because he knew that that reincarnation was coming. That's right. All mm -hmm. right. And that judgment was going to hit them. That's right. Because that's the thing, you know, especially the, the, these Edomites that are, uh, you know, the the, on the the upper echelon, you know, they actually know some shit. Yeah. They know once. Babylon is done. Mm -hmm. All right, that means their kingdom's gonna fall, and they know that they got a, 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 a thousand years of hardcore slavery. That's right. right. No give or take. That's right. You know, it's coming. Mm -hmm. Right now, yeah, they, they, they they're in heaven, but that hell is coming from the man uh, yeah. for them. Yeah. Okay. Hey, can see our hell is their heaven, and our heaven is their hell. That's, That's right. right. And look, just, just, just for edification's sake, it's a condition, yeah. okay? Because hell is not some some place in the middle of the earth. You're going to hell. You know? Right. Yeah. You got, you know, demons everywhere. It's fire. Yeah, you get your You're ass in a pit. Fucking, fucking Quentin yeah. Tarantino from Little Nicky. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you know, that, no, that, 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 that's something. That's Greek mythology. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. What is it, Hades say. and all that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And, they, and, and just a little, you know, history of background on that. They pushed that. All right, in the churches, all right, during, um, you know, when they had like the Black Plague and all that yeah, stuff, yeah, yeah. because they wanted to control the masses, yeah. control the money. They want them ties. That's yeah, what it was yeah. all about, okay? Yeah. You see? And then they still do it to this day, because you, it's crazy. They got these people in order just based off of that. Yeah, they got a lot of people in control because of that. You have the most violent criminal, okay? Talk about, yeah, man, I, you know, I ain't worried I'm going to go to hell. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They'll, they'll say all this shit. <laughs> I got to be, you know, I got to be good, you know, because, you know, I, I want to be on God's good side. Like, yeah. what the fuck? <laughs> That's what that nigga, what's that shit? nigga got to say? Uh, <laughs> made a hundred million, gave 10% to the pastor. The nigga still died, man. <laughs> hey, that nigga, he was a day to play shit. But yeah, that, yeah, that's, that's exactly that what it is, man. That fear tactic. Shit. Yeah. The, uh, one of the one of the, I think it was the Odiyasha Wamba maybe posted a, a short of this fuck these Jakes was they had to be in Africa or, or something because they had like a uh, that type of accent. This wicked ass preacher walk up to some Jake who broke his head. Oh yeah, Murph sent that and, to me. And, <laughs> and the fucking Jake, uh, the Jake was like, um, how much money you got? The pastor's asking the Jake. The, the nigga's like, I don't have that much money. I got one point two thousand but in whatever currency that they got over there so it's not actually a lot of money and this nigga the pastor was like give me everything you have and this stupid ass jake is yes i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do it right now and he said give me everything you have in a couple of days you're gonna see yeah. and that's and, and, and all you fools fall for that no, folly man. Yeah. and that pastor is gonna get fucked up for that for that shit that he did man because yeah. he's not only victimizing that guy He's victimizing everybody else in his so-called congregation. And that's wicked to use the fear of the Lord to try to profit and make money off people, man. Right. That's, that's, the, that's one of the worst things you can do.
I got some, but I don't know if it's for you. No, I, I finished all right. Time. This is Ecclesiastes chapter 8 and verse 11. Mm. Because sentence against an evil work is not executed speedily, therefore the heart of the sons of men is fully set in them to do evil. Keep reading after this a little more. Time. Time. Say. Though a sinner do evil a hundred times and his days yep. be prolonged, yet surely I know that it shall be with them that fear Yahweh, which fear before him. Exactly, man. Hey, even though it seems like hey, they're, they're getting away with the crime, eventually it's going to hit them, man. Yep. All right? And then, hey, look, man, hey, give real quick. The Lord's going to, um, what is that, Sirach 10 and 4? Yeah, yeah, Sirach 10 yeah. and 4. He, he's going to give the, the power, all right, to those who are more profitable. See, really what, what, what the mm -hmm. Lord is making Esau and these other nations and even two-thirds of our own people do is, he, he's making them prove that they're not worthy, all right, to control the, 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 this uh, dominion here. No, yeah, you, you guys are a bunch of no-good scumbags, and it's going to get stripped from you. I'm going to give it to the lowly, the meek, the humble, yep. all right? Hey, the scriptures say what? The meek shall inherit the earth. That's right. All right? Because, look, if, if you're proud, that means uh, you're, you're uh, what does it say? Um, uh, uh, pride is when one departed from his maker, all right? That means you're wicked. Simple right. as that, because right. you ain't in order. That's right. And in this order, it, 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 all it does is breathe nothing but fucking uh, um, a destruction, corruption, yeah. all right? Confused. Confusion and death, man. That's all right. right. We, uh, bring it out. Con, this is Rock 10 and 4. The power of the earth is in the hand of Yahweh, yep. and in due time, he will set over it one that is profitable. And, that, and that's what's happening right now, man. All right? You're starting to see a transfer of power. Now, it's not in... Uh, a full effect yet, all right? But you're starting to see Esau's kingdom, all right? And anybody that's attached unto it, their, their power is starting to slip away. Yeah. You're really seeing it, okay? If you got them spiritual eyes, and as time keeps going, hey, we're, we're, we're becoming more valuable. Mm -hmm. We're be beco uh, becoming more powerful, okay? Our stock value is, is rising. That's right. All right? And like I said, we're about to cash out soon. That's right. All you people are going to be through. That's right. That's all right? right. You see? Yeah, they, they're all about to be through very, very soon, man. It's only a matter of time. And it's coming, man, because look, this can't, this wickedness can't keep going on forever. All right? And then you see all these things that are happening in the earth. Mm -hmm. Come on. We're almost there. But, um, you know, we're going to end this lesson. We've got to get back to the main camp. And hopefully whoever was listening was edified. With that, we're going to give all praise and honor and glory to Also, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone and salutations to all you brothers out there. Shalom and a Baba Ba. Baba Ba. Shalom.